Hey friends, it is Saturday morning and I don't know if I have introduced, I think I have actually, I think I made a video on my cow. So for Christmas, my boyfriend got me a cow and oh, there's my dogs up there being very naughty. So I got a Christmas cow from my boyfriend. He asked me, did you want to go shopping or do you want a Christmas cow? And I said, I would love a Christmas cow. So along came Holly. <laughs> and Holly is a four-year-old Jersey heifer. She's never had a calf before. And she came to me bred. And she is due to calf like any day, any minute actually. And I think she might be in labor right now. So I'm gonna go check on that really quick. <laughs> okay, so it's happening. I can't believe it. I'm so excited. I'm trying to be quiet because I want things to be really peaceful for her. But oh my gosh, this is crazy. shaking right now. <laughs>
Good girl. Oh my gosh, that, that was the craziest thing I've ever seen. Oh, I probably shouldn't like wipe my hands on my face, but wow, calves are slippery when they come out. The goats are all excited. Oh my gosh, she had a little heifer, a keeper, we had a keeper. Oh, 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 oh. It's the next day and I am still just riding on that birthing high like that was the most radical thing I've ever seen on the farm before and I'm so impressed with Holly I just can't even believe that that's her first calf and I mean just how instinctual mother nature is is just so amazing so I don't know if I mentioned this yesterday but I decided to name Holly's calf fern I was debating between the names Clover and Little Bit, and then my parents were like, we don't like those names. And then all of a sudden Fern came to me and I was like, that's the one. I need to have like a plant name. I need to have a little plant theme here for the cows. So Holly and Fern, I really like that combination and I feel like it suits her really well. I put the girls in last night in the barn just for safety because I don't want them out there in case any predators come by or you know, just alleviate the potential for things to go horribly wrong. So they slept in the barn last night and I checked on them. I have a camera in there and they were snuggled up with each other, just looking real cute. So Fern, first thing this morning, she jumped out of the barn and she ran around and Holly was following her and mooing, but Fern's doing really well. She's snoozing a lot. She's eating a ton, which is great to see and I'm really excited for this new adventure. So I know this video is a little different from what I've been posting. I've mainly been sharing horse content, but I'd love to kind of integrate more of my lifestyle into these videos and kind of give you guys a glimpse of what I do on the side besides the horses. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. I am working on some videos. I'm trying to get consistent, but you know how that goes. Life happens. We're having fun out here, but I will see you all in the next video. Bye.